Hello and welcome to my course on UDP socket programming in csharp.net. I am Naeem Akram Malik, a long time Udemy instructor and a senior programmer with a lot of experience in socket programming. In this course, you are going to learn how to write code for connectionless socket programming using UDP sockets in csharp.net. UDP sockets are very popular in IoT applications due to their fast and easy to use nature. They are also the mainstay of voice over IP industry, multiplayer gaming, video streaming and IP TV technologies. This is a hands-on course. You will learn by creating a real-world chat application. I will also show you some important debugging techniques as well. Let me tell you about the course contents so that you know what to expect. You will first of all learn some basic concepts needed to start network programming. After that, you will learn what are UDP sockets and you will start using them with very simple coding examples. Once you understand how UDP sockets work in principle, we are going to move towards some more sophisticated topics. I will show you what is asynchronous programming and how you can use asynchronous programming to make your own networking applications more robust and responsive. We'll create a class library for this purpose and we'll also create the GUI for the chat client and the server applications as well. Once you'll get familiar with asynchronous socket operations, I will show you how to implement a publisher subscriber model. You are going to bridge the gap between the backend class library and the GUI inside this section. We are going to fire custom events from the class library and we are going to create event handlers to take care of those events. In the next section, I will introduce you to JavaScript object notation, also known as JSON. We are going to use JSON to create an application level data exchange protocol using Newtonsoft JSON.NET API. Next up, we'll look into how our chat clients can send and receive images and other byte data. We'll update our chat application to send and receive images. After completing this course, you'll be able to create your own practically useful network applications in C Sharp with connectionless UDP sockets. Several preview lectures are available so that you can get a feel. So what are you waiting for? Click the enroll button and join me now.